Southern Oregon football team is off to the same start as the 2016 season, 0-2. They're by no means in panic mode, but there's plenty of room for improvement. In Saturday's loss, one SOU player took full advantage of his chance to be a full-time starter. 2019 for redshirt junior Michael Chisley is about taking advantage of this season's opportunities. It was uh, kind of my first first time being in this position to you know being a starting starting uh, player on this defense, and you know it's a great honor to do that. And um, you know I've always had the confidence in myself, like that I knew that I could uh, play and excel at this level. Um, Coach E has always had that confidence in me, so it was just a matter of you know waiting waiting for my time and going out there and doing it. Against the visiting Eastern Oregon Mountaineers, Chisley had two interceptions on defense and two passes broken up. He tacked on five solo tackles to round out an impressive defensive showing on Saturday. But maybe his biggest play was a kick return in the first half. If they're kicking off, we just gave up points, you know, and they've got all the momentum, and then all of a sudden we come and we bust off a big one and we go right back down the field and score. It's able to, to balance it out, almost swing it back to our side to where we feel like we have the momentum and we're kind of riding that wave of positivity and getting those guys back on their heels on the other side of the ball. The offense did score on that drive, and SOU took the early lead thanks to Chisley's big return. But if you ask him, the offense should have never been on the field after that kickoff. Um, yeah, I was upset because um, I should have should have scored in the play. Honestly, um, you know, kicker should never make the tackle. Is what I was taught. You know, he made the tackle in the play. And like, um, yeah, it was it was a good uh, good play to set up the offense and everything. But honestly, it should have been a touchdown. So I'm just kind of kicking myself, you know, for not making that play. While he was upset for not taking the return to the house, he was more upset that the Raiders couldn't pull off the win after a last-second touchdown from Eastern Oregon. The team will reset this week and prepare for its toughest opponent so far this year, the College of Idaho. Now we get to go on the road, you know, hopefully get away from everything, just relax, and then you just have this mindset of, you know, once we get to, to Idaho, or Caldwell, excuse me, that this is the only thing that matters to us. We're not in school yet, you know, so let's make the main thing the main thing, and let's rock and roll this thing and get this train back on track.